What is your single favorite episode of any TV show and why? The injury from the office. Michael burns his foot on his George Foreman grill. Dwight gets a concussion. Tons of hilarious lines. House of Cards Season 2 Episode 1. Chapter 14. You just don't duck with the Underwoods. Remedial Chaos Theory. Season 3 of Community. First time I've seen a sitcom use that narrative device to tell a 22 minute story and it was brilliant. Ozymandias from Breaking Bad. No episode of any show has struck me on such a monumental level that this did. The Nightman Cometh Always Sunny in Philadelphia. I don't really watch the show. I've only seen about 3 episodes. But a friend of mine showed it to me. And it's the funniest single episode of TV I've ever seen. Edit. First gold. Thank you. Make Love Not Warcraft South Park. Literally watched it over 10 times. South Park Scott Tenemon must die. Andy and April's fancy party from Parks and Rec. It was one of the most heartfelt, feel good episodes of the entire series but still managed to maintain comedy. Three stories from House. It's smart and witty and the way the story is told is really creative. Plus, we get to learn the truth about what happened to House's leg. Seinfeld. The contest. Master of my domain. More than the conversation results in George, Jerry, Elaine, and Kramer entering into a contest to determine who can go for the longest period of time without masturbating. Episode 1 of Archer because it's, well I had a reason, but I was imagining Horror Island. The episode of Lost where Sawyer finds out that Locke's kidney stealing dad who pushes his own son out of an 8 story window, crippling him for 4 years is the same conman who caused his parents death and then strangles him to death. The IT. Crowd. Season 2. Episode 1. The whole episode is funny, but the very end cracks me up every time. The Reigns of Castamere episode in GOT. By far one of the most shocking moments I've ever seen on TV. The episode left me speechless at the end. It was one of few instances where the villains won and I honestly had no idea where the show was heading after that. Two Cathedrals The West Wing. Martin Sheen at the top of his game. The best episode of an amazing show. Community. Cooperative calligraphy. A bed calling the bottle episode. The characters going through each other's bags to hilarious results. The dialogue throughout. Especially ones like Nice Try. Stephen Fry. And Anna's boobs actually being seen taking the pen at the beginning. Just a brilliant bottle episode with a great cast of characters with awesome chemistry. My screw up. Scrubs. So clever. And sad. Sobs. Arrested development. The writers knew that Fox was cancelling the show. And they made a whole bunch of jokes about it. Just a fantastic episode. The opposite Seinfeld. My name is George. I'm unemployed and I live with my parents. Cape Fear. The sideshow Bob Rake scene kills me every time. True Detective Episode 4 Who Goes There is the only thing I've ever watched on TV that had me so nervous tense that it gave me a tummy ache. It also made me use the word tummy ache. The Sopranos Pine Barrens episode where Paulie and Christopher get lost in the woods after shooting the Russian guy in the head. The Wire season 4 finale. Final grades. It's the perfect season finale. It wraps up all the storylines of the season. But unlike most seasons of the show, in which the penultimate episode of the season has the big climax and the finale cleans up the pieces, Final Grades is pretty thrilling throughout. It also has some of the most heartbreaking moments of the series in it. Friends. The one with Ross's tan. Oh my god is it ever ducking hilarious. Really never gets old for me. Also. The one where Ross is wearing leather pants. So good. The Office Scott Tots. By far the cringiest episode I have ever seen. I hate cringe humor but that it was funny. Blink. Because it's the best episode of any television show. Simpsons. Itchy and scratchy land. It's impossible to park my car in a lot without quoting this very episode. The Michael Scone video episode of The Office. Threat level midnight. 
whenever Michael explained how he paid all the extra money for the special effect to blow up Toby's head. Never laughed so hard before. I don't really have one single episode but I do remember when I watched 33 minutes. The first episode of the new Battlestar Galactica, after the miniseries. I was like damn. This it is awesome. Turns out it was one of the most amazing series I ever watched. Futurama Anthology of Interest I and I I. The first slap bet episode of How I Met Your Mother was first of the many episodes that came to mind. I swear I had let's go to the mall in my head for weeks. Flu season parks and rec. The job the office. It's sappy. But I really love that Jim and Pam finally get together. Buffy the Vampire Slayer. I'd have to say the Buffy musical but there was also this episode of Buffy called Normal Again which was so eerie it kinda made me feel like this show was about a crazy girl living in a fantasy world. I think that was a masterpiece of an episode. Joss almost discrediting the entire Slayer theory with this was Boldimo. Crossroads of Destiny, Avatar The Last Airbender. Workaholics Season 1 Office Campout. Parks and Recreation The Fight. Something from Futurama. Maybe Jurassic Park. Classic episode. Six Feet Under Finale. That montage at the end really gets me every time. Bizarro episode of C-Lab 2021. The Constant Lost. It was incredibly beautiful done. Had sci-fi elements that worked. Made me cry. And was the best episode of Lost. The episode of Trailer Park Boys where Ricky's goldfish or Angie dies but still thinks it's alive. Edit. Holy duck I love licorice. Blue Harvest from Family Guy. Even if you don't like the show. It's still hilarious and a genuinely good parody of Star Wars. My musical. Scrubs. S06E06. BC Guy Love. Black Mirror's the entire history of you is one that comes to mind. I don't know if I have a favorite episode of any TV show, but history is the most thought-provoking. Star Trek, The Next Generation The Inner Light. Psych. Last Night Gus. I can watch that episode all the time. Breaking Bad's Ozymandias. Suzin's Comet from Avatar. Or S3E9 The Reigns of Castamir. Red Wedding. From Game of Thrones. From the top of my head. Doctor Who, Blink, Monk, MR, Monk and the End, Part 1 and 2, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., Turn, 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 Top Gear, The Reliant Robin episode, and pretty much all the specials. Bart gets an F from The Simpsons. It teaches the harsh reality that you can try your very best and still not succeed. Kinda hit home for me, personally, comma. Prison Break, last episode of season 1. The evasion. Even if I know exactly what happens during the episode, I am more stressed than ever for the whole episode. Every time. Mizumono. Hannibal season 2 finale. It's one of those episodes that is the culmination of something that has been building all season. The whole episode and in some ways the whole season comes down to a confrontation between the two leads although there's plenty of drama. Surprise and plot twists before that. The dialogue. Delivery and general acting in the aforementioned confrontation is impeccable as is the choice of music which complements the episode perfectly. The Scrubs episode in which Dr. Cox's friend played by Brendan Frazier died and Cox was devastated at the end of the episode. That episode left me with so many emotions. An always snide and sarcastic character like him being broken down like that. The White Bear episode of Black Mirror. Think it was season 2 episode 2. The Reichenbach fall from Sherlock. So well thought out. Fast paced. Smart. Love it. The office stress relief. The fire drill and Stanley's heart attack episode. Stanley. Berek is president. You are black. Stanley. Save bandit. X-Files. Small potatoes. It might not be my actual favorite. But it's what immediately popped into my head.